Hey guys, welcome back to Resident Evil 2. Leon Kennedy is hanging in there, just barely. He has had a really rough day at work. And it's his first day at a new job, you know how it is. Just, your, your colleagues turn out to be total assholes. Your boss, who has, who is supposed to protect the new guy, is like no, a no-show. Which is actually a good thing, considering how he is, but Leon doesn't know that. Leon's probably thinking like, wow, what a shame I never got to work with that Chief Irons. What a stand-up guy. I, I, I've idolized him since since I was a child. I mean, I don't know if... Oh, shit! <laughs> my god, that's just my luck. Oh, well. Hey, you know what? Uh, I am going to use this and mix another super mixed herb with this guy. See, everyone wins. Well, not Leon, because he just got bitten. Does this seem a little strange to any of you that when there's a zombie uh, movie or a game, the lore always says that whenever you're bitten, sometimes even just scratched, you turn into one of them. If a character is bitten, he's a goner. And this is true in every single zombie related media ever made, right? But apparently, Resident Evil protagonist for some reason is immune to this. They can get bitten plenty of times before, before maybe succumbing to their injury. And when they do, uh, I don't think we need this anymore. And, and even, and when they do, it's uh, when they do succumb, it's like uh, due to blood lost or something like that. It's never, we never really see them turn into the zombie. And I kind of want to. I kind of want to see a. Uh, Zombified Leon or Claire roaming the, the streets of Raccoon City like like the rest of them. Oh, I'm taking a long turn, but th that's okay. This is we're here we're here already, and this is kind of the safe way to do it. So we got the power panel that we need. Wait. Oh, I'm not allowed to come here anymore um just drop down there will ya come on Leon be a good boy well this is unfortunate um this essentially means we're gonna have to go back to the station and face Mr. X once again which I had hoped to avoid I thought this was supposed to be the shortcut Okay, I'm back. Didn't take long for me to be back. So let's plot this course more carefully. Uh, let's see. Go to police station. We're coming out of here. We go to the east floor corridor and to the break room here and then we go downstairs into the generator room and all that just to come out of the parking lot and go to jail yes that's our event eventually we are going to jail oh no no not again I hope Mr. X isn't like in this part of the building it's gonna be really awkward if he is Nope. Uh, I think I took a bad turn. Oh, I, I didn't have. I didn't prepare any ammo on me. What a dumbass. 
By dumbass, I mean me, not Leon. Well, by extension, also Leon, because my operation is a, a representation of his skills, and I'm not representing him very well. I wonder if Mr. X can come down here, because theoretically, the, nothing should really be stopping him. Where am I? Yes, I'm going the right way. Oh, I do remember Mr. X in this parking lot along with Claire. Oh, good times. So, in light of the immense danger we're about to face here by opening those jail cells, um, I'm just gonna play it safe and uh, save the game here. Okay, I'm ready to go. Let's tackle this bitch. Uh, just to clarify, the, the the bitch is a reference to the entire situation, and I'm not and I'm not talking about Ada. I'm not I'm, I would I would never. Bad mouth Ada as Leon. That's just not gonna happen. Yep, not getting in there. Take the panel. And we gotta complete this puzzle again, but we should be able to do fine. I mean, I got it working the last time, I, I, I didn't even know what the hell I was doing. supposed to direct the three charges here. I think it's a little different. I don't think this is exactly like how it was with Claire. I think they spiced it up a little bit. Okay. So everything has to come down here. Interesting. Time to work this out. Now, obviously, some of these don't really have a choice. So that actually narrows things down a little bit. This one has to be connecting all of them, I suppose. Wait, actually, no. Not all of them. There we go. There we go. Are there doors open too? Okay, Ben's memo. Let's read this. The station's swarming with monsters. Even here I can hear their cries. But it's not the zombies I'm afraid of. Codename Tyrant. The ultimate bioweapon developed by those bastards in the utmost secrecy to think that a thing might be wandering around here. Chances are they've ordered it to wipe out the witnesses. That's what Mr. X is doing. Wiping out the witnesses. Oh man. Oh that got really juicy. Well Ben I think you should work on your tech uh, techniques a little bit. But 
he was still one hell of a reporter to be able to dig out this much and uh, rather accurately. We gotta give credit where it's due. Parking lot, garage, card. Yes, that's what I need. What are they after? Oh, I wonder. Okay, should I? That's not good. Oh, I probably should have killed them in their cage, just like did with the dogs and the Cornell. Well, chalk them up to the millions of mistakes that I've made during this playthrough. Uh, like I'm totally failing to shoot this guy properly right now. Oh boy. Um, nope. Beyond, come on. Oh, this weapon is pretty badass when it's close enough. If there's anything in their cell I can get. I shall probably go this way. Just saying. Oh shh. Give me a break. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. X. Uh, I'm probably missing a lot of stuff. Uh, maybe I'm not missing any stuff. The, the place is all blue and oh shh. Yeah. You're kidding me! Yeah. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit! Hey! Twice. Who's I didn't keeping count? I'm keeping score. Yeah. Look, this isn't a game. Oh, you Nothing dies down here. I know, right? I take it you have the key card. Yeah. And this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. After I hear it, let's get out of here. Ooh, somebody is turning up like a good barbecue. Can I actually see him behind this? Nope. And those guys are still there. We might want to open the shutter. Um, uh, maybe. I wonder if those zombies coming here will, will either actually shoot at them. <clears throat> so let's do an ammo check. I have exactly one bullet. I think he heard it in like needed? five times no. speed. Well, what exactly are you looking for? More info on the people responsible for this mess. 
What about you? Trying to save the world? Yeah, well, someone's got to get word to the authorities. We need reinforcements to save this city. Gun shop. <sighs> By the way, Raccoon City looks really freaking good, but it's only a small portion of it. Everything else is cut off, so I'm hoping f I have high hopes for Resi 3 in this regard. Seeing more of the city. There's a. Yeah, I can see that. Going through that gun you, shop looks like the only you really need to walk up here to realize the road is out. Anyway, there's a, a police station as level in the original Resident Evil 3. I heard it's cut out in the uh, remake. I hope that's not true. What a mess. It would be nice to revisit the police station as Jill. Ha, look at me. I am so accurate. No, I'm not. Not really. But hey, Ada doesn't have to know that. Um, what are you looking for? Are you like Barry just staring at a pile of blood for no reason? Okay, Ada, this is freaking me out. I'm I'm gonna I'ma go ahead. Ugh. Hey. Uh this barrel belongs with you. Wait, no. Okay. Oh and it's also give me some ammo, that's nice. And a more grenade. Every bit helps. Yeah, when the zombie apocalypse bro breaks up, I I imagine a gun shop would be the first thing everybody decides to rob. Letter to the shopkeeper. Chasing jail. I got a trophy. Whoa. Uh, it seems like you've got your reasons for staying put, so I'll trust you to take care of yourself. Still, if things get worse and your other arrangements don't work out, you know where to find me. I'll do everything I can. Jill Valentine. Jill. I miss you. We'll be together soon. Seriously, you're gonna put up all this target practice inside your shop? I mean, shouldn't that go to the backyard or something? You really want people to shoot up your own store like this? I'm sure it's just for show. I'm not gonna hurt you. I said don't. Move! Shit, I didn't pay. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I kill you are. You gotta turn around and go right back out the way you came in. I think your daughter needs help, sir. Don't tell me how to deal with my daughter. Drop it. No! Wait! Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. Terminate. Fucking daughter. Ada. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Daddy. did to us. You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? Um, it's actually my first day. Like, I didn't even go she through orientation. Mommy. Mommy. I was sleeping, honey. Okay. And I'm gonna... You're to bed too, okay? Emma. Just go. Just give us some privacy. You know, 
It's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. We may not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city, count me in. Well, that was kind of heartbreaking. This were these uh, parents with their dead children completely take the fun out of a zombie apocalypse. If you are one, uh, if you are looking for the second shot, maybe the. The shop owner shoots himself out of guilt. Um, it's not gonna come because in the, I think there's an extra story in the game where you use uh, where you play as the gun shop owner after he shoots his daughter. His other arrangements that Jill mentioned in her note is for him to be evacuated by some friends. That you have to like play through a survival mode or something like that to to get to that, and it's super difficult. I I tried it a long time ago, didn't didn't go very far, and uh, that's about it. Heard of the Umbrella Corporation? They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. I don't know about indestructible. The things I've seen. That's why I'm looking for Annette Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. Speaking of which, how did the original T-Virus get leaked out again? Just in the canon story? Did it happen when William... This is how we get to but William injected himself with the G virus. Seems fitting. Well said. Uh, After you. G. Thanks. <sighs> Can't imagine a real scientist being down here. According to HQ, this leads right into Umbrella's secret facility. Come on. The sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? Welcome to corporate America. Umbrella's <sighs> controlled Raccoon City for years. <sighs> Leo is so green. Uh, by the way, I am hurting Leda. If you can, if you can see that, you got anything that can help me? I mean, I know asking for medicine is kind of a big deal in these troubled times, but maybe emotional support. Jesus! That an earthquake? I sure as hell hope so. <clears throat> oh. What the hell? Stay shot. God only knows what's down here. I'm sure God at this moment is like, no, you leave me out of this. Did I miss anything? Well, it is red, but it's not showing anything. Okay, let's save. And we have everything we can possibly have. We just don't have a lot. I'm gonna take this in case we get any ammo for it. I am... Um... Nah, this is good. I'm good. We're good. We're all good.
Ada. There she is. She's so cool. Look how in control she is. While Leon is here just panting for his life. Leon, are you sure you're not gonna search through the garbage to see if there's anything you can, you can use? Come on, survival horror this. Again? It's not too late to turn back, Leon. No chance. Okay, I'm turning back. The end. No. Turn back where? The only way back is to the police station. Who wants to go back to the police station? Ugh. You sure this is the right way? Unfortunately. Wait there. Okay. Leon! Get out of there! Yeah, no shit! Whoa. All the legends are true! There are crocodiles in the sewer! He's trying to dodge his bite. Yeah, that's pretty badass. Chew on that, you overgrown son of a bitch. Oh, sorry, Leon. I I disturbed your little monologue. Look at that. Well, Leon, up here. I'm not cleaning up after this. What the hell was? Just get up here. Oh, so what? You're telling me I didn't actually need to jump into a pile of shit and get chased by a Godzilla-sized crocodile? Can't did say I didn't warn you. How did she you get the virus here? turned people into monsters, not reptiles. Fair point. I'm just impressed you made it in one piece. <sighs> Umbrella sells monsters like that to who? Our military? Somebody else's? They don't sell the monsters. They sell the viruses that make them. And Annette is who makes the viruses. As scary as that alligator was, Annette is far more dangerous. Actually, I think it's... Isn't it... Would it be better to just to sell the monsters? I mean, why give other people the technology? I'm totally thinking in a super villain kind of way, but I'm just wondering. I'm just thinking maybe the formula is the most valuable thing out of all this. And those tyrants are certainly, you certainly can sell them as weapons. What is she doing, Ada? Are you okay? Okay. Definitely William's handiwork. Identify yourself. Annette Birkin. She's who we're looking for? Not much time. Need to dispose of it. We're here for the G-Virus. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. I'm warning you, Doctor. Oh, yeah? Hey! Stop! I didn't expect 
that from a scientist. Uh. Leon. Forget about me. Just go. Stop her before she gets away. Oh. I'm right outside the facility, in pursuit of Annette. If it's not on her, it must be in the nest. Once it's in hand, I'll call for extraction. You can run, Annette, but you can't hide. We are going to be playing as Ada for a while. Damn, she looks good. Uh, this guy does not. What is that? What is that thing protruding out of him? I think it's just part of the infrastructure. Maybe how he died, how he died again. So what do we have? We have one broom HC, 9 shot capacity, 9 millimeter uh, double action semi-auto handgun. This piece is one of a specific limited run of 5,000 pistols. Okay. EMF visualizer. This is another weapon we got. A device capable of detecting and projecting EM fields onto walls in real time. It can also be used to remotely control some electronics. It's secret weapon time. Yeah, that's that's what spies say when when they operate. Um Cool, we got the fan working. Do we really want the fan to work though? Oh, we want the fan to work, alright. Great. Candy I got from a baby. What? Like taking candy from a baby? It I'm I'm not sure what I think that whatever f phrase she says at this point should mean it's easy. Okay, let's check out where it leads to and uh, hack in that. Oh, come on. Oh, there we go. Nope. I'm gonna just stay back a little bit. suppose he's gonna give me any ammo I'm surprised how little ammo Ada has on her September inspection week one I already put in the request last week but we absolutely must have a replacement ID wristband ASAP we need one to gain access to certain areas of the main facility in other words me and my crew can't get to the places we need to in order to do our job right now so I don't want to hear anyone accusing us of slacking off that's a fair point Let's keep using the super weapon. It's fun! Puzzles in the walls. 
Don't you just really want something like this in real life? Seriously, if I have this device uh, in my hand, like, that's how I will be doing everything. And everybody will be so annoyed. Oh, that's good. I love hearing the sound of vomiting in the morning or the afternoon or the evening because you know what I get to do this where is he okay we need to clearly we have to uh, activate the elevator we need to get through this guy I think Ada's shooting is maybe it's her shooting hand. It's very steady. Maybe it's the weapon she's using, but yeah, it, ma it makes sense that she's she's a better shooter than either Leon or Claire. I don't know if I, I, it's my perception of them just bleeding into my ability to play this game, or is this actually by design? Because I feel more comfortable shooting with her. This goes all the way here. What the hell? No, please don't stand up. Wow. What this guy is this guy really sucks. I'm trying to figure out a puzzle here, dude. Uh, one bullet left. But she's fine. Apparently she's fine. Are you kidding me? Please drop dead. He's not dropping dead, is he? Where is this going? They're both walking. What the heck? What do I do? What do I do? You know what? I'm gonna have to lure him in here and try to get around him. Where's the other guy? Is he with you? Oh, just fucking great. Ah, oh, damn it. You know, just in this case, it's actually not my bad shooting that's ruining the day. They just refuse to die for some reason. Okay, I'm following this, but... It's not really leading anywhere I can go. <sighs> I'm getting a little turned around by the place, but... It's also partially because everything is so dark. Oh, this is where I supposed to go. Oh, 
Oh, come on now. Nope. to do this a few more times. How do I get there? This PS4 is like so dark I can't really see this. Wow! That's dedication dude. Oh, look at that. Some health would be nice, but hey, work with who you got. If you're just gonna crawl on the ground, I'm... Okay. Ammo's just not panning out for these type of zombies. Nobody dies. <sighs> Please stay dead. Please stay dead. Now where where the hell was I? Oh, there it is. I'm really not good with maze-like places in the dark. Oh my god, just die, please die. He just... This is like totally struggling. I wish someone can somebody can just turn on the light. Maybe it's my monitor. Maybe it actually looks better. A net. There yeah, you are, you bitch. Well, they Always can't follow me up here. Give you that. How did she get through here without? You know what? She's probably controlling all of this. So. Not gonna question that. Persistent faster. Ah, oh, that music. I'm not. I can't deal with this. Oh no. I'm out of health, dude. Is there any health items for me? Nope. How the heck am I supposed to do this? Oh no. Oh. No, I do not need assist mode. Thank you. Do I choose yes or no? No, I do not want to I don't I don't need assistance. Why why do you think I need assistance? This is 
the B scenario. Did I need assistance in the A scenario? I actually it offered once when Claire was like struggling with the with William Birkin's second boss fight, but that was a one-time scenario. You know that was it. This isn't a norm. Got you now. Always been good at running. It. Give you that. The chief problem here is Ada really just cannot this take any hit. Bastard, aren't you? this in a civilized way okay this is better because he doesn't outright kill us right now and it gives us the time to run see the wisdom well there's no actual wisdom in here but it's all about getting punched in the right way. Can we go now? Can we go now? Yes! Bye! Phew! Okay. <laughs> Ada seriously needs some herbs. Uh, we need some. We need some power to open this door. Nope, I do not have ammo for you, Mr. Raccoon. <sighs> Nothing for me here. <sighs> I hope this turns, uh, when the video is processed, it, it, it's a little brighter. But right now I'm looking at a pitch of dark. With a new wristband that's just arrived, we can finally begin our survey of the demolition area. As to the report from the other day about the incinerator, it's nothing really. Probably just a large piece of leftover trash. I'll go take a look myself after I wrap up this report. Do I want to know? Ah, damn it. Can we just uh, hack into that? I want to hack into everything. Okay. We spend. Uh oh. Bravo. What a bitch. Gonna burn me alive now. You'll never get your filthy hands on the G. I'm not the only one after it. You realize that. And you won't die alone. Okay. What to do? Where am I? Oh. Okay, I seriously need to work fast. The 
channel to right here. Wait, 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 wait. My mistake. Ah, that could be a fatal mistake. Huh, no. What's going on? Where the hell is the last one? Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Just a little bit. Woo! That bitch knows what she's doing. <laughs> okay. That was pretty close. That cat really close. But hey, we're a survivor. That this is quintessential action, right? Visitor clearance confirmed. Your ID is you're not, until October. You're not a hero or Please even an anti-hero if you don't not just escape at the very last millisecond of everything. Where do I go? Not this way. This is a dead end. You ask, why do you go to dead ends? Well, I ask, in turn, how would you know if it's a dead end if you don't try it out? see it that way tell me is your husband still alive or did you kill him so you could take credit for G interesting theory you don't cooperate I'll get a sample from the nest over my dead body Shouldn't have worn high heels. Where's Leon when I need him? Speaking of which. Ada? Damn it. Find Ada. Ada? Where are you? Yeah, I know Leon just like took a shot in the back, but with the power of the magical herbs. Oh, there that's her coat. Do we wanna bring her coat to her? She might be cold. Uh, I'm assuming this is because to restore the power. And we got basically everything. We're not going to take the wooden boards. What are we gonna do with boards now? Are we gonna board up some window in the sewers? Yeah, you're uh, literally waiting in your own shit. Well, I think Le this is Leon's first day. He probably hasn't really taken a shit in Raccoon City yet. 
I can't promise that he hasn't, you know, done it elsewhere in the city instead of in the toilet. I'm just gonna stop. This is getting weird. Hey, shotgun ammo. That's that's it for the upper waterway. Digital video cassette. Oh yeah, we're watching a movie tonight. I'm warning you, sir. Damn it! You killed Kenny. Well, this guy looks like he's a professional. That speaks very well for our chances. <sighs> Treatment facility. Uh, we're gonna need a key here. The Sura key, I remember. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Oopsie. Can't get in here now. I remember this place giving me a ton of headache. You know what? I kinda want to explore over there, so I'm just gonna put this back. It's not like we need a part out right now. Again, what about this way? This way takes us to what? Oh, another little dagger. This is the lower waterway. Um. I need to refresh. I need to refresh on the geography of the whole sewer. But where does this lead me? Whoa! What just happened? Shit! <laughs> Literally. Oh no! I remember this place. Not everything is friendly down here. Oh, hey. Gives me more shotgun ammo. <sighs> I think I see a little Billy here. No! Wh what the heck? I, w I was just passing through, dude. Get off here. I definitely do not want to. Oh, wait, where the hell? I'm going that way. Jesus, turn me around, bastard! I don't think I I have enough stuff to fight him, and I think I do have enough stuff to fight him. But if I do try to fight him right now, he's it's going to take like every single little bit of ammo on me, and I don't want to do that. Because ammo is a very scarce currency right now. <sighs> Who 
what do we have here copy of emails to umbrella hq uh did i ever read this oh i think i did to director owens where'd she go sewer company got screwed And where does this go? I don't like the sound of that. I'm coming, Ada. Oh no, the zombies are turning up the trash compactor. Oh, that's probably not gonna happen. Would be cool if it does, though. Getting the sewer map. Such a big place. Okay, guys, I'm gonna sign up for today, and in the next episode, we are going to be retackling the sewer system. This time as Leon, and I expect a lot of trouble because if you remember, I, as Claire, I really, really struggled with this level. I was like low on health and uh, ammo throughout the whole thing. I'm surprised that I don't think I died as Claire, but I'm not as confident here because this this scenario is the second run is definitely more difficult. Uh, the way I was playing as Claire, it doesn't completely work right now, so. Yeah, it, it, this is a right. This is the right time to get a little concerned, but you know what? We're gonna find a way through this. It's. The, I don't think the good thing about Resident Evil is it stresses you out, but it's never unfair. It's never undoable. So I will see you next time as we explore the sewers again. Thank you very much for watching. See you then.